Joe, I want you to tell me about some of the potential risks of this shoot. Um, the dogs could walk in and we could trip on them. Uh, there's a few... <laughs> there's, um, there's a few um, like wild on the floor. And uh, so we've got to just talk to move them out of the way or put something that will be protected on them. Okay. How can you minimise the risk, the dog risk, dog trip risk? Uh, show the doors when we're filming. It's yeah. So you can show them away. Yeah. Okay. Any other risks? Exactly. Um, uh, no. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there is no. Okay. You're not going to suddenly stop filming and start playing on an Xbox or anything? <laughs> no. Who do that? Okay, no risk from that. Okay, Emilio. Yeah. Uh, tell me about the power. Power, what do you mean power? How are you going to power your equipment? Oh, there's like plugs in the kitchen, wasn't there? Uh, there's like some weather catalysts on the side, like there's like a table like thing surface unit and some plugs inside. So you can use them. My dad just called me crazy. Okay. Plug crazy. Crazy okay. tasty. So how many, do we know how many, uh, how many pieces of kit we're going to have to plug in? Uh, probably only the headlamp and maybe the camera if it gets low on battery. Okay, so you just need pl two plugs? Yeah. Uh, oh, well, we're, the, no, that's it, yeah. Just the, we might need to take some spare batteries uh, for the um, task cam though, because that always runs out of batteries on me. Okay. Adam, tell me about the potential different filming locations in the house. Uh, it's quite cramped, but there's possibly just one or two or three-ish locations because there's not a lot of space, so... Okay, tell me about them then. Yeah, just so the kitchen is small, but it's big enough to do the interview for the equipment. Yeah. But for doing the living room, there's a bit more space there, so it's safer, but the first location is a bit... Right. Okay. Oh, do you know that uh, circle rig thing? The what? The circle rig. Oh, yeah. That's, can the fig rig. DSLRs. Yeah, I need to talk to you about DSLRs. J uh, Joe, tell me about the lighting in the house. Uh, the lighting is really good, um, both in the living room and the kitchen. The kitchen, especially, because it's got white um, kitchen tops and okay. white cupboards. The light is on top of everything, uh, and there's two windows as well. So if we start uh, eating his dad on a stool, if he was all right with that, we could. The, there's light in the back, yeah, uh, and there's a lot of ceiling light, so it's really well lit, and the living room is really well lit as well. So you don't need any additional lights. We probably will just to light the back light and maybe a master light. Okay. But I think that might be that. Okay. Eden. Yeah. Oh, and you tell me about acoustics. The acoustics is alright. It's because of all the stuff that's in the kitchen, all the curved edges, all the TV, um, the cupboards, the fridge and stuff like that. Cancels it out, so it's quite... It's not echoey at all. Okay. Quite a nice sound. Okay. Do you all do you all agree? It's nice. So did you nice. test it? Yeah. Yeah, we tested it. Clapped a few times, talked and stuff like that, and it worked. Okay. It sounded quite nice. So what's uh, what's the best? Ideally, what would be the best room to interview in? Kitchen. It would, would it? Okay. I'm, conf I mean, I'm interested as to why you've chosen the kitchen and not the living room. Or oh, I think I personally think the living room would be a good choice as well. What is it about the living room that makes a good choice? There's a picture that I've got on the phone with this big this seat that my dad sits on. And he like religiously sits on that seat, so I think if we get him where he's the most comfortable and the most prime, I think that might make him a bit more relaxed, mm -hmm. in, in a sense. And what about the acoustics in the living room? They're all right in the living room. 
through because there's a lot of stuff in the living room, like carpet right, surface. So you, start, so you type in something and you get this. A lot of stuff on the walls. Okay, and what do carpets do to the acoustics? Uh, Emilio. Oh, 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 Cancel them down and make them less, uh, and make the sound waves lower, but uh, let them less frequency. Yeah, stop the bounce. Um, <laughs> okay, any ideas for shots? Uh, probably the mid shot and wide shot for when we're in the house. Uh, but when we start to go outside and uh, do a bit more holes, uh, we'll probably use a few more wider shots and mm -hmm. probably tracking shots. Okay, sounds good. Right, 